Hi, this is Martin Alvarado, and today I'm coming to you, giving you a quick mortgage minute, some general information about uh, home mortgages and the process. And today I'm going to talk about the process of escrow, the steps that it takes to start escrow and close escrow. And um, the home buying process is very simple. Obviously, first and foremost, uh, you have to make a decision to purchase a home. So once you make that decision with yourself, your significant other, uh, you make a decision to purchase a home, the very next step would be to get pre-approved by a mortgage lender, direct lender, uh, such as myself. And that person will be able to analyze your income and your credit and make a decision and grant you a pre-approval letter so you can go out and start shopping for a home. Uh, now, may many people unfortunately make the mistake of skipping this step and go right into looking for a home and then they might find that they may be troubled in qualifying for the home that they want because they skip step number one. So again, step number one, get pre-approved. Step number two is contract a realtor, someone that can fit your needs, that you blend good with, um, and that person can go out and help you find a home that can fit your criteria and let you into homes. Uh, let's, when you actually find the home that you like, you're obviously going to place a bid on that home. And placing a bid on that home, uh, you are hoping for the seller of that home to accept your bid. And if that does come true, then you have now come into contract and in what they call opening up escrow. Now, in many cases, um, the seller will ask for a good faith deposit for that bid that you put on the home. And that basically means is that you're giving that deposit in order to hold that home and make sure that he doesn't go and sell it to someone else. So you've opened a escrow. Um, now it's the job of the lender to start executing your mortgage and opening up and getting you a full loan approval because you have opened a escrow and there it now it now is time to perform. So the lender has op uh, now gotten your full loan approval and it's all packaged up and now it's all done, appraisal's in, and it's time to sign your loan documents. So loan documents is basically the execution of your contract where you are now uh, releasing the seller of their uh, liability. You're putting the liability of the mortgage and the home and recording that home in your name and done deal after that. So those are the basic steps of purchasing a home, uh, from finding a home, making a decision, and executing and having the keys to your new home. So that's what it takes. If you have any more questions, please feel free to reach out to me. I'm always available. Thank you and have a great day.